Awards of Valor were handed out today to some of the LAPD's finest for bravery in the line of duty. More than two dozen officers receiving special recognition for not firing their weapons in a life or death situation. Here's CBS 2's Dave Lopez with more. With a thousand people today at the downtown Bonaventure Hotel attending the annual Above and Beyond Award Ceremony for the LAPD, this is what the mayor told the audience. If you turn on the television these days, you'd think that all police officers are doing are bad things. In honoring the 58 officers today for going above and beyond, the LAPD added a new category, preservation of life. Officers in a life-threatening situation who did not use lethal force. Why didn't you shoot? Why? Um, I believe at the time that using a lot of tactical language, it worked. Officer Daniel Lopez had a man point a rifle at her. He kept walking toward her. She kept talking. Finally, he dropped the weapon. It was a replica assault rifle. How close did you come to using your weapon? Very close. Very, very close. And they're able to, to tactically work through a situation in a way they don't have to shoot. And we should recognize that, too. To preserve the life of another during a volatile or dangerous encounter. And today, 25 officers received the Preservation of Life Award. The chief said what these officers did was an act of heroism, an untold act of heroism that he said the time has long overdue that their actions be known to the public. The chief said these awards do not overshadow the Medal of Valor winners or the Purple Heart recipients, but rather just adds to the list of the LAPD heroes. I present to you the Los Angeles Police Department's 2016 Preservation of Life Award recipients. From downtown Los Angeles, Dave Lopez, CBS 2 News.